Good afternoon. Uh, this is the solution of problem number 142. Chapter is integration by the method of substitution. So far, I have shown you the solution of total uh, 141 number of problems from the, chap from the same chapter. Okay. This is problem number 142. This problem is so short in size. Means the length of the solution or the size of the solution is so, so small. Integration of dx divided by root over of 2x minus x square. So this is the given problem and the solution is of course very easy. Here this is equal to integration of dx under root. Here you can see uh, we can write this one this way minus x square minus 2x. Can you write this way? Yes. Of course this can be written this way. Okay, then this is equal to integration of dx and here x square minus 2x is there, so we can write this way. This and this are same or not? No, they are not same. If you expand this, you will get x square, so x square is present, then minus 2x, minus 2x is present, then plus 1, but plus 1 is not present. Okay, plus 1 is there. This negative sign is here. I have done the same thing here also. So here you will get, you are getting within the bracket plus 1. Negative sign is there, so minus 1. So to adjust this, we have to write here plus 1. Now this and this are same. Okay, now let x minus 1 is equal to z and differentiate both sides and both on differentiation we are getting this one dx is equal to dz okay therefore the given integral becomes integration i is equal to integration of dz divided by root over of 1 minus z square and formula for this is known to you this is nothing but tan in, uh, sorry sine inverse z not tan inverse it is sine inverse z right plus a constant of integration c and z is 1 z is z is x minus 1 so this is equal to sine inverse x minus 1 plus c so this is the answer to the given problem okay sine inverse x minus 1 plus c x minus 1 is that okay so this was the solution of problem number 142 in the next video, we will show you the solution of problem number 143. Chapter will remain the same, that is integration by the method of substitution. After completion of this chapter, I will move to uh, a new chapter on integration, that is integration by parts. Okay. And I think that is very interesting chapter for all the students having mathematics as a compulsory subject. Okay. Thank you for watching this video.